hello students good day and welcome back to this channel once again in today's video we are going to continue our lesson on percentages we are going to focus more on discount now if you are new here make sure you subscribe to this channel do well to like this video and share this video to all your friends now without wasting much time let's get into today's lesson discount is the practice in some trade to sell goods at a price less than the original price to especially some regular customers and others who buy goods at large quantities. Now such a reduction in the original or the marked price is called the discount and is usually given as a percentage of the marked price or the original price of the article. So basically when we talk about the marked price and the original price, we are talking about the same thing. There are two types of discounts. We have what you call the cash discount and the trade discount. The cash discount is a discount given to the buyer because he or she makes an immediate payment of a good. And then the trade discount is a discount given to a fellow trader on prices of goods bought. Notice that the value of the original price or the marked price is equivalent to 100%. So always, the original price or the marked price is equivalent to 100%. Now, given that X% percent is the discount or X is the discount, then we can find the new price by using the formula 100 minus X divided by 100 times the original price. So you can use this approach to find the new price. Now, if you want to find the original price, then the original price is equal to 100 divided by 100 minus x which is the discount times the new price also if you want to find the discount allowed then that is equal to the reduction in price divided by the original price times 100 percent now in this case we have the discount allowed to be in percentage for instance if you go to buy a good which is marked at 75 ghana cities and then you are given a discount such that you buy the good at 72 Ghana cities. The reduction in the price is going to be the original price minus the new price. So that is 75 minus 72 divided by the original price, which is 75 cities. And then you multiply that by 100%. Now that is going to be the value of the discount. Now, if you want to find the amount saved, then that is going to be the discount divided by 100 times the original price. So basically, this is how to find the new price, the original price, discount allowed and the amount saved. Now let's move on and solve some problems. So let's try our first example. A company reduced the prices of its goods at 13% during a promotional sale. A product was sold for 435 Ghana cities during the promotional sales. What was the price before the promotional sale? Now let's try this question together. So from the question, we are told that a company reduced the prices of its goods at 13% during a promotional sale. So what this primarily means is that the discount during the promotional sale was 13% and this is going to be the X value. So after the reduction, a product was sold for 435 Ghana cities. So that is going to be the new price. So new price, new price is 435 Ghana cities what was the price before the promotional sale so this suggests to us that we are going to find the original price now we said that the original price original price is equal to 100 divided by 100 minus x times the new price So we have original price equals 100 divided by 100 
minus x we have x to be 13 that is the discount times 435 cities now we can simplify this to become 100 divided by 87 that is 100 minus 13 and then we multiply that by 435 100 divided by 87 times 435 gives 500 so we have the original price to be 500 Ghana CDs so this is the value of the original price now let's move on to our second question so for question 2 the marked price of a bag was 9 Ghana CDs John received 18% discount for a cash purchase of the bag. How much did he pay? From the question, we have the original price of the bag to be 9 Ghana cities. So original, original price, that is 9 Ghana cities. So that is the same as the marked price. We are also told that John received a discount of 18%. So we have discount of 18%. How much did he pay for it? In other words, what is the new price? So the new price is equal to 100 minus X divided by 100 times the original price we have x to be 18 percent and then the original price to be nine Ghana cities let's substitute these values into this equation so 100 minus 18 divided by 100 times nine Ghana cities So we have 100 minus 18, this gives us 82 divided by 100 times 9 Ghana CDs. So when you multiply 82 divided by 100 times 9 Ghana CDs, then we are going to get 7 CDs, 38 pesos. So that is going to be the new price. The new price of the bag is 7 Ghana cities 38 pesos so let's take the last example or the last question question 3 the marked price of a dress is 95 Ghana cities a discount of 10% is allowed for cash payment a what is the new price and then b how much does one save for paying cash for the dress okay so let's solve this question Now we are told that the original price or the marked price for the dress is 95 Ghana cities. So we have original, original price to be 95 Ghana cities. And then we have the discount to be 10%. So discount is 10%. A, we are going to find the new price. So the new price is given by 100 minus X divided by 100 times the original price. So that is equal to 100 minus X is the discount. So minus 10 divided by 100 times 95 Ghana CDs. So this becomes 90 divided by 100 times 95 Ghana CDs. So when you multiply 90 over 100 by 95 Ghana CDs, then you are going to get the new price to be 85 Ghana CDs, 50 pesos. 
so this is the new price so for B we are going to find how much one saves by paying cash for the dress now we have two ways in solving this you can say that the amount saved amount saved is equal to the original price minus the new price so that is going to be original price is 95 Ghana cities minus the new price 85 cities 50 pesos when you subtract 85.50 from 95 cities then you have the amount saved to be 9 cities 50 pesos now for the second approach you can see that the amount saved the amount saved is equal to x over 100 times the original price So that is x is the discount so 10 divided by 100 times 95 and this is equal to 9 cities 50 pesos so whichever way you solve it you are going to arrive at the same answer so that's it for today's video thanks for watching and see you in my next video bye bye